Ranked 22 in the world, Tatiana Golovin has quickly climbed the ranks of women's tennis and has claimed some big scalps along the way. Along with partner Jérôme Hanel, she is representing France at this year's Hopman Cup. Tatiana loves horses, so when we suggested a trip to some local stables, she was happy to take a very short break from her training. You ride much, um, Tatiana? I actually started riding when I was about eight, mm -hmm. and uh, I used to do quite a bit when I didn't travel as much, and now with like all the injuries, it's a little harder, but um, you know, whenever I have some free time, I ride, really try to ride off horses. Hey. So that was your Christmas present. Oh, was it? <gasps> I want a Christmas present like you. It's like Ooh. it's from the Lord of the Rings. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, it's a free range pony. They're the most delicious. No, joking. Did you go out there? Don't say that. <laughs> Was there ever a choice between competitive riding and competitive tennis? No, no, no. I just really, you know, go ride for fun, actually. But um, you know, tennis has always been, you know, the kind of the love of my life. So. No, I don't want to trade that for right. anything. But I would love to have horses one day, as soon as I get like a big house and like a lot of land, for sure. And I understand your father um, was an ice hockey coach. Is that right? Uh, yeah, it's one of my other hobbies yeah. too. I love going out, uh, you know, ice skating. But like I said, I just don't have time anymore to do any of it. But uh, definitely, I got my skates at home, and I've been pretty much my first sport that I did was when I was about three, and I used to, you know, help my dad out with, you know, putting like the cones on the ice ring and stuff. And um, I actually played hockey on my like under eight dad's team with all the boys so that was fun. Joining Tatiana at Hopman Cup 19 is Jerome Hanel, a late but very welcome inclusion in the tournament. What's Tatiana like? Oh, she's very very funny but very nice. I didn't know her before before this tournament and she's very yeah very nice. Excellent, yeah. excellent. Pleasure to play with? Yeah it's a pleasure. Can you tell us a bit about uh, your partner Jérôme? Mm -hmm. yeah. Well actually, you know what, I, uh, I, I mean I knew him by name but we didn't spend much time together in Paris at all. So it was pretty much the first time actually getting to know him and uh, you know, he's a really, really nice guy and uh, you know, we've been playing really well so far so hopefully it'll continue. You've played some, some Grand Slams, what's your, what's your most memorable experience from the, the tournaments you've played? The centre court in Paris at the French Open, you know, always has something special for me because that's kind of where I practiced. And you know, when I was little, I used to go up all the way on the stands and kind of watch everybody else practice and play. So it just always has something special for me. Can you walk the streets of Paris and you know, uh, unbothered by people? Uh, or? You know, you kind of wear your hat and you kind of you know try to go unnoticed. But um, it is getting more and more difficult now. But you know, I don't really mind. I think it kind of comes with the job, and I'm just you not know, happy that people enjoy my tennis and, and are actually and watch. On tour, how do you relax? Like. Obviously, well, this being is here right yeah. now. <laughs> no, you know, you just try to go to the pool if there's a pool around, and you try to get a lot of sleep in, and you know, go to dinners and hang out with some of your friends if you know if you if you meet somebody, and um, just uh, kind of get your mind away from tennis a little bit. Tatiana Golovin's past success has marked her as a player to watch, and if her demeanour on and off the court is any indication, she is the makings of a great champion. Hopefully that was a kiss, alright. <laughs>